Everything you need to know about the Jake brake, how it works, and why it's essential. Every day, the automotive industry advances, improving both the internal and external features of the vehicles available on the market. Today, you'll learn about one of the main braking systems in the trucking industry and why it's so important. So, take a seat and fasten your seatbelt because this exciting journey is about to begin. What is an engine brake and why is it important? Many may wonder what an engine brake is and why it's so essential. Here's a brief explanation. As the name suggests, engine brakes are a type of braking system that works through the compression generated by the engine to slow down the vehicle. They are mainly used in heavy-duty vehicles such as trucks and buses that require significant braking power. These brakes not only provide additional stopping power, but also reduce wear on traditional friction brakes. How does an engine brake work? Engine brakes function by restricting the flow of exhaust gases from the engine, creating back pressure that forces the engine to work harder. As a result, the engine slows the vehicle down. Now that we understand the basics, let's dive into one of the most well-known engine braking systems on the market. The Jake Brake. How it works. The Jake Brake, or Compression Release Engine Brake, is the most common engine braking system in the industry. It works by opening and closing the exhaust valves at specific times to release the compressed air trapped in the cylinders. This process creates back pressure, slowing the engine down. Essentially, the engine acts like an air compressor that absorbs energy. Instead of transferring energy back to the crankshaft, the Jake brake releases compressed air, which is why it produces a loud noise when in use. This distinctive sound is a signature feature of the Jake brake. Advantages of the Jake brake. The Jake brake offers several benefits, including reduced wear on friction brakes. Since the engine brake handles a significant part of the braking process, it extends the lifespan of traditional friction brakes by up to 50%. Increased braking power. This system provides additional braking force, making it highly useful on steep hills and when transporting heavy loads. Improved fuel efficiency. By reducing the need for friction brakes, it can enhance fuel efficiency and decrease overall braking system maintenance costs. Disadvantages of the Jake brake. Despite its benefits, the Jake brake has some drawbacks. Noise. The biggest downside is the loud noise it produces, which can be disruptive, especially in residential areas. Reduced speed control. Using the Jake brake alone can make it harder to maintain precise speed control, particularly at lower speeds. Increased emissions. Frequent use of the Jake brake can lead to higher emissions, which may impact environmental regulations. How to use the Jake brake correctly. Using the Jake brake is simpler than it seems. All you need to do is reduce the vehicle's speed to a lower gear and take your foot off the accelerator. The engine will then begin slowing the vehicle down. To further decrease speed, friction brakes can be used in combination with the Jake brake. When should you use the Jake brake? Like traditional braking systems, engine brakes generate heat, especially with continuous use, which can lead to faster wear. To maximize performance, the Jake brake should be used alongside friction brakes rather than as a replacement. The Jake brake is particularly effective in these situations. Descending steep hills, it helps control speed and prevents brake overheating. Transporting heavy loads provides extra braking power when carrying heavy cargo over rough terrain. Driving on slippery roads in cold climates, the Jake brake can slow the vehicle down without locking the wheels, reducing the risk of skidding. The importance of engine and air braking systems. When comparing different braking systems, it's evident that heavy-duty trucks use air brake systems rather than the hydraulic brakes found in passenger cars. This difference is due to the specific demands of commercial vehicles. A truck's air brake system consists of an air compressor, storage tanks, pneumatic lines, and brake chambers. When the brake pedal is pressed, Compressed air is used to apply pressure to the brake pads, generating friction to stop the vehicle. This system provides reliability, performance, and safety, making it an excellent choice for long-haul transportation 
heavy loads, and challenging terrains. Conclusion Now you know everything about the Jake Brake and its essential role in trucking. If you found this information useful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe so you won't miss future videos. See you next time.